Okay, so I just got back from my appointment um, with the skin doc no, with the dermatologist. Dermatologist, and I might be going on Accutane. It's a very high chance that I'm going on Accutane, and I'm actually crying about it because I'm so happy. I just want this acne to go away so bad that I'm desperate for this, and I was really unsure if I actually get the medication or not, but I am getting it, and I'm so happy about it. Like, I am about to cry, because this is just affecting my life in such a big way, and finally, I'm gonna be able to do something about it, like properly do something about it, and I hope and pray, even though I'm not religious, I hope and pray that my acne really goes away this time and that it stays away and that this will work and you better be sure that I'm gonna document every single thing of it for you guys so that you can see the raw and honest truth of how Accutane will affect me because I bet you I'm not the only one with acne if you're watching this you most likely want to go on Accutane because uh, I know I watched a hell of a lot of Accutane videos before I went to the doctor now and I'm gonna watch a hell of a lot of Accutane videos right now so that I can prepare myself for, for the dry ass Sahara that is about to arise on my body so that for me but <clears throat> Yeah, I just thought I wanted to let you guys know how I felt. This is like my first Accutane documentation, I guess. This is the start. So my doctor just had to, or my dermatologist just had to, uh, like, reaffirm. No, had to talk to my psychologist about it because there's some risks of getting depression and such. And I've already been there. I don't want that. So... They're gonna talk, chit chat together, but most likely my psychologist wa will sign off, sign off on it, and I will be going on Accutane or Isotropin, Isotretinopin. What's it called? Just ready to get it this over with, and I am excited to document my experience with you guys, cause I know that when I start, when now that I'm gonna start it and when I was thinking about starting it, I watched a lot of videos on it and that really helped me decide if I should go on it or not. That really gave me the courage and showed me that yes, it's worth it. Usually it's worth it. So I just hope that this will work. It's been almost two weeks and I still haven't gotten the clear. And I'm getting so impatient. If you can see my skin right now, it looks horrible. It's only getting worse. And I just want to start on the medication, please. I'm so tired of looking like this and feeling like this because it really hurts. I have like six small pimples right turning into one right here. So I'm really getting impatient and I really just want to go ahead and start and at least when I'm on the medication and it gets worse, if it gets worse, I know that it will get better eventually. Right now I'm just so sick and tired and I've kind of given up actually. I just feel helpless. I don't know. Yeah, so I'm just waiting for the doctor to call and I really hope it's today so that I can do my blood, so that I can get my blood done so that I can start in three days. But it doesn't look like he's gonna call today, so... So, it's day five of Accutane. This is the first day I, like, properly, properly done my makeup. And I can really tell a difference. Like, <laughs> my skin is... I didn't think that my skin was getting that dry. But now that I've put on foundation and stuff, I can definitely see a difference from now and five days ago it, uh, I don't know if you can see but it's definitely clinging more to around my nose my chin is 
like really bad. It's clinging to my chin. And my skin overall is just really having a field day. <laughs> my chin is filled with painful red cystic acne and I just can't wait for it to be over and I really yesterday I had like a really bad day I just really felt not very pretty I also dyed my hair and it didn't turn out the way I wanted it to so I had like a really down day about myself but today I'm up I'm feeling better and it's just so painful it's unvaryingly painful like just by talking now my whole chin area hurts so much it's kind of stretching and it's tight and itchy and it's just it's getting really dry as well but so far it's only been five days but so far i'm quite happy with how it's going uh, yeah it's painful but i kind of was prepared for that and I definitely haven't experienced that many side effects yet. Uh, now, it usually takes about two, one to two weeks before you can properly see that it's working or feel that it's working, like feel, get uh, side effects and get dryness and all of, all of that for it to like properly set into your body. So I've definitely not gotten like the full effect of it yet. Uh, but pretty soon that'll be happening and I will keep you guys updated during this whole journey really and so far it's going pretty well it hurts like a bitch but you know what I just gotta suck it up and get through okay so I've been on Accutane for a little over two weeks now and this is with like a little bit of mineral powder over it just to tone down the redness this is the redness toned down toned down so like the big purge has started and it's kind of hard to be honest as you all know it's kind of hard to deal with acne and especially when it gets really bad really lowers your self-confidence but you know trying to feel cute and all so hopefully it works i really was prepared for it and you know you're prepared to get like a purge you know sorry if this is really shaky you know that you're gonna get a purge when you start accutane but the thing is you think to yourself okay it's fine i'll get clear skin it's fine just give me the purge it's fine then you get the purge and you're like, why the fuck am I doing this again? But, clear skin, y'all. I mean, it's not that bad. It could be worse, but it just hurts a lot. And my skin is itchy and yeah. Yeah, so I'll check in with you guys in about a week when I've been on it for three weeks. And then I'll do like a recap yeah bye okay hi sorry about the background uh i don't know if you even can see what a mess it is also sorry i look like an absolute mess but it's fine because it's just like a quick video it's a quick video just to sum up my third week of Accutane and I've been filming like little updates throughout the whole or throughout all of the weeks it feels like I've been on this drug for like two months but I clearly haven't <laughs> so <laughs> but overall sorry I'm just I, I'm just a mess okay overall it's going pretty good it's Sorry, this is, my, this is my microphone, by the way. It's I started on September 3rd. I did my blood work the 30th, 30th of August. And I'm going to do another blood test the 30th of September now. So next week. And yeah, I started September 3rd. 
Now it's September the 23rd, so I've been on it for 20 days. The symptoms I've had are dry lips, obviously. The first symptom I actually felt was dry eyes. So yeah, yeah, dry lips, dry eyes, joint pain. Oh my God, the joint pain. My knees hurt like a mother trucker and my back hurts and like my hips. I feel like an old woman, like my whole like hip area or the whole like hip bones, the pelvis and all of that really hurts. So <laughs> that's fun. Other than that, I've had dry cuticles, like a son of a bitch, dry cuticles. And this one cuticle of mine has like opened up and started bleeding and it hurts really bad. So yeah, this is my second week. <laughs> only my no this is only my third week and it's already a pain in the ass i wonder how it's gonna be in two months so uh, makeup wearing makeup is a hassle my face is getting really dry my foundation tends to bunch up or smudge off around my chin and my nose my nose is like really dry yeah, so makeup isn't like my favorite thing to wear at the moment because it itches and it just I don't like it also I have bleeding gums if I brush my teeth too hard <laughs> so you know <laughs> that's fun I have a little bit of a fever going but I almost always have a fever so that's really not really not a big deal for me um what else can I uh, update you about? This is a more me type video to make really, showing you guys my favorite Accutane products. Okay, so these are the products that I have been using so far. And they are working. I think they're working. It's just that my skin has to get used to, used to it and all of that stuff. So I've been using this hand cream, the AHAVA. Dead Sea Water Mineral Hand Cream. This smells heavenly and it's suitable for sensitive skin and it's allergy tested so it won't irritate your hands. Then the lip balm I've been mostly using is this Smith's Rosebud Salve. It's been like okay. It's worked pretty good actually until now. My I've started getting like couple of cuts on my lips which really hurt so today I went out to buy the Aquaphor soothing skin balm and this already works like a charm my lips already feel so much smoother and I also put it on my cuticles to help them heal a little bit because you can put this pretty much all over because I can't reapply lip balm during the night my lips tend to dry out much quicker as I said so I've been using the Le, what's it called? The L L Laniage. Laniage? Is that how you pronounce it? The like pink lip mask that everyone uses. <laughs> I got a sample of that one, so I've been doing putting that on at night, and it really helps actually. It really works to just keep your lips soft and. Sorry, I'm waving my microphone a lot. To keep your lips soft and just moisturized during the night. Then moving on to lotion and cleanser, I've been using the CeraVe Hydrating Cleanser. This is the one that everyone recommends. It's good for morning and night, it just feels clean, feels hydrating, doesn't strip your skin very much. So far, I like it. Then the most moisturizing lotion I've been using is the CeraVe Moisturizing Lotion and this is for dry to very dry skin. This is also pretty good. Uh, at night I use the the moisturizing lotion and then about every other day or so I use the summer Fridays jet lag mask because I have a little sample of that one as well and that one I love but yeah that's it so far it's going well it's not like my favorite thing to do I actually can't wait to get clear skin because I have been going through like a bit of a purge but you know what gotta get worse before it get be gets better so I'm gonna be doing continue doing Accutane updates so if you're interested in that subscribe 
give the video a thumbs up and if you're also on Accutane, comment down below and we can bond over this hellish, hellish journey together. I make videos every week, two times a week, sometimes even three times a week. So it would be great if you could subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!